Good morning everybody. It is about 20 past 9 on November the 4th. It's crazy. Well, I keep forgetting it's November. It's, it's flying by. Oh, and tomorrow is a bonfire night or a Guy Fawkes night or whatever you want to call it. Anyway, so today is Sunday and it is the day of our pigeon release. Yeah, so here he is sitting on this box and I've got to get him into this uh, cat carrier box thing then I'm going to go and take him down to the woods and set him free there and it's not actually great weather today I'll show you I'll show you out the window so you can have a look check it out it's pretty rainy but better than there being loads of fireworks tonight so yeah that's what I'm that's what I'm thinking and he should be okay <clears throat> in the rain plus it's in the woods so it's going to be fairly well covered and yeah, and he's a pigeon, so he's probably quite used to living outside. Anyway, I'm going to go and set him free now, and uh, I'll pop him in the box, and yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Well, here we go guys, one boxed pigeon, here he is. He's sitting in there, he's not looking too happy in there, but I'm not surprised. It's not a very nice place to be. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go and take him down to the woods now, have a quick wander down there. Um, and find a nice place for him to be set free. So, I'll probably see you guys when I'm done there. Yeah. Well guys, I'm just at my little little area to set the pigeon free now. Um, I decided to bring him down to the place where I actually made the first Shade Timber video. Oh, I've got to be careful not to get water on this camera, but yeah. I thought it would be a good, a good little area to set him free. Um, and so you got water on your lens. There we go. Um, yeah, so this is it. This is where I'm going to set him free. Um, but it's okay. It's fairly, fairly covered from the rain over there in that area. So I'm going to, going to probably walk over there and then set him free. And I've also seen some other pigeons around, so that's a good sign. Pigeons do actually live here, which is always good. Not the best of days to be setting him free, but seeing as other pigeons are out and about. I figure he's going to be fine. So, yeah, he's pretty, he's pretty ready to go now because he keeps flapping about and trying to escape from the box, which is good. I'll record in a second, guys, when I set him free. Well, guys, we're here. I decided to pick this place. There's a nice little tree there, and there's this huge tree in that one, um, which is going to be some nice cover for him. And then, obviously, there's all these trees and stuff as well. Um, oh, and there's a pigeon in that tree. So, yeah, let's set him free, shall we? There he is. Are you ready, Pidge? I think he is. There we go. I'm not sure if I need to coax him out or not. You okay, buddy? There he goes. Yeah. Awesome. That's a good little flight. I'm so glad he can actually fly as well. That's really, really good. Uh, I can't actually see. Oh, there he is. I'm not sure if you can see him. He should be able to. He's perching up there on that branch. Yeah. Yay. That's really good. I'm really happy about that. And there's a dog watching me. Well, um, but yeah. No, there he is. I'm going to try and do a bit of tree climbing and probably set some food out for him so he has something to eat which would be good I have all the food that I bought him in my bag ready because you know I have nothing else to do with it so I have like half a kilo of corn that I'm just going to spread around and stuff for him um, but yeah no I'm really glad yay now he's now he's set free I wonder if I can actually climb this tree it looks pretty content up there, that's good. Uh, can I climb this? I don't know. I'm going to find out. If I can climb this, it's going to be awesome. And I'm going to put some food up on those branches and stuff like that. But yeah, um, let's see if I can climb it. See you guys in a sec. Well guys, I tried climbing the tree and it definitely didn't work. So uh, what I'm going to do is kind of spread, spread his food out on that little grassy bit. And maybe a bit under the tree as well. 
and uh, hopefully he'll see it and eat it and uh, I'm hoping it will also bring some other pigeons along for him to uh, join up with but yeah he's up there now I'm not sure you should be able to see him yeah you can you can see him so yeah I'm gonna spread his food around got all this all this corn spread around for him so let's do that so what I'm gonna do just spread it around over here this kind of area there we go corn yeah so just so there's stuff for other pigeons and for him to eat in a nice little place to gather I think so yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna finish doing this throw around the rest of his corn and uh then I'm gonna say bye and head home I think guys uh, for the rest of the day I'm probably just gonna play some Assassin's Creed I reckon I was playing it for a long time yesterday and it is awesome I already said that but I'm gonna say it again it's so good go and get it go and play it it's really awesome and uh, yeah well I think we'll do a we'll say bye to bye to Pidge together and then I'll uh, then I'll take you guys home all sorted guys this area has been thoroughly corned I even threw some corn up into the tree so I'm hoping the plan was that it landed on that branch I think it worked so yeah that's all happened and uh, now I've got to head back home and um, yeah get on with the rest of my day so a little farewell to Pidge there he is sitting on that branch in the center of the screen yeah there you go now you can definitely see him bye Pidge have a nice life and stuff yeah awesome pigeon he is a good pigeon so yeah bye he's gonna be good he'll be fine I reckon hopefully there's some other pigeons around to come and uh, show him the various the various pigeony ways that'd be good um, but yeah there goes the pigeon that's all sorted now that's a, a week's worth of good deeds done. Also, before I go, I thought I'd show you this lovely autumny scene because, yeah, it's very pretty. Look at that. Ah, lovely. So, yeah, anyway, now I'm going to head home. So, I'll catch you guys in a bit. Yeah. Well, I'm finally home now, guys. It's uh, probably just past 10 o'clock now. I've got to start cleaning up where Pidge was living. So, yeah, that'll be a good, fun task for a Sunday. And, um, yeah, it was very sad letting him go, but it's, uh, you know, it's for the best. He'll be okay, I think. So, that is good. And, uh, yeah, for the rest of the day, I am going to be playing on Assassin's Creed, I think. Um, I might even try and watch a couple of films. Uh, but yeah, Assassin's Creed is the is uh, is what I'm going for today. It's it's yeah, it's gonna be a good good day, a good day. Oh, also, I've actually got to learn some stuff for work. This uh, thing called AdWords, Google AdWords. I'm kind of in the process of learning that, so uh, I'm gonna do that as well. So. Yeah, it'll be a good day, I think. Um, yeah, I'm going to edit and upload this vlog now and get that all sorted and out the way. I just wanted to film releasing the pigeon, really. So, yeah, um, that sounds like a euphemism. Maybe it, maybe it could be now. Releasing the pigeon. Yeah, think of that what you will. And, uh, yeah, guys, that has been my Sunday. I am going to do some gaming and some learning and a bit of cleaning as well of pigeon poo. So that's going to be fun. And yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow again. I'll do another one of my weekly vlog things. So yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.